down a call out locally to a swan that's got stuck in a sludge tank. Okay, I can smell sewage. Right, let's go and see what we've got. No fall in there. How long do you reckon we've been in there? Well, it's probably an hour, but we, I mean, we could have been there from then from last night. Right. Well, we've got the swan, he's incredibly weak, all but dead, to be honest. He could have been in that sludge all night, we've no idea. But all we can do now is get him back to the centre, get him warm, and just see if he'll come back at all. But it's not going to be that easy, I don't think. He's in a pretty bad way. Well, it's Simon behind the camera, because we've got no camera in today, but I just called Lucy in on a day off, which is very mean of me, but I'm really worried about the swan. What do you reckon, Lou? I mean, you haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen him but... yet, but I'll see when he gets brought in. Just don't film my face. Very, very, very poor prognosis. He's in a terrible state. At least the fluids are warm. But other than that, we've just got to get him dry and get him warmed up as quick as we can. I'm just going to try and get him on a drip. Oh, right, baby. You landed in a stupid place, didn't you? Just trying to dry him off a bit. He's so wet. It's really wet underneath. Mm. And as long as he's damp like this, he's just not going to get warm. It's horrible for cygnets, really. You think this time of year, the mother drives them off. And not only has he been driven off by his mum, but he's landed in a mm. lake of poo. We think we're having a bad day. So we've got this amazing donated piece of equipment which is going to make his fluids the same temperature as body temperature so that he's always getting warm fluids going in. Well it's been a pretty traumatic day for us. Lucy came in on her day off. Everybody was doing every single thing they could to help that swan to live. If we'd been called to it quicker, an hour or so earlier, it would have stood a far better chance. In the end I'm afraid it just didn't have the strength to make it through despite our huge effort. We always put 100% of our effort into any animal. And when we lose an animal, it is heartbreaking for us every single time. But because we managed to save 70%, we will keep striving to do exactly that. We do our very best all the time. It's just such a shame that this swan didn't make it.